Hello ladies and gents and welcome to Old Kiwi Farm by Kaz64. Hello ladies and gents, welcome to Old Kiwi Farm by Kaz64. Now in the description, Kaz has put, welcome to Old Kiwi Farm. Here you will find 52 small to medium odd shaped fields. That's worker friendly. An easy place to start farming on several average fields. The map has quite a bit of detail wherever you look. This is an old field to it. It's loosely based on where I grew up here in Hawke's Bay. And I invite you here to try it out and see if you like it. BGA, Animal Dealer and Cell Points are old and that gives a feel of a kid being, when he was a kid running around. The map is seasons ready and custom precision farming ready. It has extra fruit with custom made textures. It has placeable areas spread over the map for you to place your own stuff and is ideal for multiplayer. Thank you very much. There you go, that's by Cal64. So here we are. Ha, huh? here we are. Chickens. Chick, 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 chicken. I'll lay a little egg for me. Can't do any more. Um, so that's 500. Go on, blimey, Charlie. That's a decent sized uh, chicken pen right there. So let's have a look at the map before we go any further on the PDA. Here we are. We will just scoot out a little bit. So we're on two fields and the farm area itself from the get go. Now I did come in in farm manager mode i always got these mixed up i have to have a think there um, and you have nothing no buildings none of this is here nothing at all niche nada you don't own any land you don't own any vehicles everything is uh, empty only only the fencing is there that's it let's get back and have a look so the fruit types are extra you've got your standard stuff no, I've not got my global company icons in. This is a bit weird for me. Looking at the base stuff. Come on, Giants. Pull your finger out for 22. Carrot. Coffee. Onion. Millet. Mustard. Sargum. Tomato. Rye. And rice. Now, I can tell you this is for all platforms. This is on console and PC. There we go. Look at that. Your two fields are ready to harvest from the get-go. That's a thing, isn't it? Well, if you're playing non-seasons. Normally they're uh, ready for cultivating and things. So that's a nice thing. And you're going to start with... What's your fields here? Tomato. And wheat, by the looks of it. So a little bit of straw. A little bit of a new crop. Lovely jubbly. Let's have a look here. So there's your cell points. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 cell points. We'll go back here. We'll just have a look at the price of the BGA. Seventy-eight thousand. So it's not going to break the bank. So there. That's the shop. Placeable area down here, here, there's a few, there's a few, one over here, rather large fields from small, let's have a look at the price of the fields, we missed that bit didn't we, so 48 looks to be the smallest I would say, or 18, so here we go, 150,000, oh, a bit pricey, 230 something, 22, so they split up. I thought that might have been a double field there. 140,000. So you're going to need a bit of uh, gelt to get you going. Let's have a look at the biggest field. Uh, would it be four? 1.2 million? 1.3 million? Two hundred and seventy-four thousand. Just here is a... Oops. Forestry area for 1.2 million. There's contracts on the fields. There's transporting contracts. 
That's all tickety boo. No animals to start with. Let's have a look. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Starting equipment quite a bit. Let's have a look at the starting equipment. Here we go. So we've got a case 7250 Pro. We've got a T6 um, New Holland. We've got a Warrior truck and the MF Activa 7347 Massey Ferguson um, combine. 8600 capacity. We've got the Tetradoss T40, the 50,000 capacity, and we've got a Distinction Belly Dump trailer. We've got a normal agro liner trailer. The header for your Massey. We've got a corn header. Don't usually start with them. That's nice. Tomato header. That'll be for your first field if you start without seasons. We have a small two and a half meter plow. A cultivator. A cedar with um, these are all done for your extra crop types. Oops, there we go. Cedar there with these crop types. And we've got a cedar planter there with these. We have the Brennell K105 spreader. Holds for, well, that was an extension, we know that. <coughs> Fertiliser of lime. We've got the Novacat bat wings and normal um, 3.1 metre mowers. You've got a tedder, you're a windrower. Goodness gracious me, you've also got a forage wagon. It's all kicking off. Lots of stuff. Wonderful. A baler wrapper. We've got an animal, uh, the Joskin water tank tanker, which holds 12,000, by the way. Not the usual, is it 7.8 or, or something? So it holds 12,000. You've got a front load around, bucket, forks, bale spikes trailer for your um, header, a weight, a large cow pasture, here we go, rather than running around looking at them, 500 in the cow pasture, large sheep pasture, 250, chicky cute 500, we already know, the grain silo holds 100,000, double doored shed, couple of open frontage sheds uh, oh you've got electric <laughs> fence gate there and your farmhouse so quite a quite a bit of tattle quite a bit of tattle to get you going let's have a little look around at the fly around the map and uh, well I'll take it from there
So folks, a nice looking map, I think you'll agree. Right. And what I like is, uh, there's a river goes across the map. And there's not just one bridge. I've seen many maps with rivers and stuff going across the map. And just one bridge to cross it. This has got, what, four or five bridges, I noticed. There's these nice pull-through shed. Rusty looking beams. Absolutely beautiful. Whoops. Let me just drop down, because I'm being all up in the air there. So we've got what looks like a sheep area. Water feed inside there. I've got the animal pen extension. There's the electric gate. So you could sell that and uh, put a, um, a normal gate on because it is sellable. It's that up to you. So there we go. I've got the uh, annual pen extension so I can put water in if I wish. Food. There's your wool area. Tickety boo. Oh, good God. Let's get out first. Electric cube myself. What a plenty of room in the yard. You know, for swinging round and turning around and doing all your diddly. Manure, slurry. So got to be cows, cow by point. Feed trough. Goodness gracious me. Interesting. Lovely. I like the uh, kind of weeds and thistles there. And uh, a water point there, if you don't have the animal pen extension, with your Joskin trailer to water your animals. Where does this go? Look at that, I'm inquisitive already. So those are rolled out the farm there. And down that way, beautiful. Let's uh, nip over this way, have a look at our tomato field. There's the tomatoes. Say so this is on console. So a nice size field. Let's go to our wheat field, which is to the south. And a lovely. Why am I jumping up when I've got this? Lovely little field there. So you could hack the trees down, make a little bit of lumber, a little bit of extra coin. Nice field over there. Lovely jubbly. Right. Now, we'll have, we'll have our big daddy moment. Let's uh, let's reset a vehicle. And uh, see where it spawns. Harvester. Reset. There we go. So it resets at the shop. There's the harvester right there. Right, let's get a vehicle and have a little trip around the place. I have one right here. Oh yes! So, which way are we going to go? Go out of here, I think. Do a right, up, around. We'll go and have a look at this. Clive Warehouse. We'll come across this bridge. We'll go into the biogas plant come around and um, we'll join up with this main road here come down here past the shop we'll come past Lucas all you got and the animal dealer we'll come down and um, we'll come over to Hastings Wall and back up to the Fonterra dairy I think And we'll try and zoom out so we can see a bit more of the map. So we've got everything but horses and pigs at the main farm here. It's a lovely looking map. Like I say, the trees at the side of the field, um, you could, when you've bought the field, uh, take them down, take them to the sawmill. And get yourself a little bit of extra coin off the price of the fields. That's a little bit of a thing, isn't it? I 
think I'm going the right way. Yes, yeah, there's a building over there. And look at this, I've not crashed. Doing absolutely spectacularly well. So, um, as you can see, undulations all over the map. It's not flat, certainly not flat. Here's one of the placeable areas right there. Nice and flat if you wish to use it for some extra sheddage. Or if you're in multiplayer and build an extra farm area. That's a uh, tickety boo. Now I did notice when I was going around as well. Most, if not all, of these cell points are the ones with the roofs on. So be aware when you're purchasing your trailers. Um, not very dump tip friendly, some of these. More your belly dump types. Or your rollers. Right, let's go over and check this bridge out. <coughs> I don't know if it's me. and I, I've, I've not got a great memory. Very similar looking bridge to... Um, oh, is it Farm Sim League? I know they've got some kind of jiggery pokery for lifting up. I like the... Oh, look at the old rusty kind of look on them. Love it. Fantastic. I like the old stuff. As many of you know. Now I'm lost. I think I'm going this way. I didn't think I was picking up the main road straight off. Little house there. Ooh. It's a bit of a deep throaty horn for a car. Uh, I also noticed that the biogas plant, and we'll take a closer look at this right now, um, there's no silage bunker, so you can place one down of uh, what size you wish. Lush grass at the side of the fields there, if you want to cut that. So there we go, it's a ground dump, uh, always a bonus for a lot of people, I don't know why I'm flying, and that looks like your pipe out, and here you can put, I don't know, double bunkers down and things like that, whatever you wish, the square one, not too keen on the square ones, they don't seem to build up around the corners, like, uh, you know, square up to the walls, the ones I've seen quite a lot of wasted space for me they kind of heap up in the middle of the square ones uh, you could put a long one down in two square ones, I don't know that's me thinking overthinking the things I'm having a look round, stop it ok let's go back down this way round the outside like a buffalo girl So there's your biogas plant. Nice cornfield there as well. If you took a loan out, chaff that biogas plant right next door so you're not doing too much uh, transporting. That's a, a beautiful, beautiful thing. So we've got another cell point here just to our right. Ooh, tree. Another one with a roof on, you see. So just be aware. Just be aware when you're purchasing your trailers. How high they actually dump, high, lift. Oops, got me wrong winker on. Let's go before him. And it's nice to see. I'm driving on the normal side of the road for me. There's the second bridge. It's only quite a few bridges. Lovely. A 
Lovely. Lovely. Just these little undulations and things. Barn sell point. Uh, barn sell point. You're not selling your barns, are you? Uh, straw, hay and... Bale sell point. That's the words I'm looking for. Bale sell point. Coming down towards the fuel station. Yet another bridge. Wonderful. So there's plenty of crossing points. And... Um, Another buildable area just over there for a farm. Whoops. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Beautiful. Oh, gas pumps. Do you know, I remember gas pumps like this. I do. I do. I remember gas pumps like that. And you could buy, like, what was it? Five star petrol. Goodness gracious me, five star. There's two, three, four and five. And they got rid of three, then they got rid of five. There's just two and four. <laughs> dear, oh dear. And then we come into here, which is the main dealer. There's the respawn point. Right there. This is where your stuff will line up. Beautiful. Some uh, lovely little bits of housing. Can't get out any further. Can't get out any further. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm, I'm, I'm going to detour slightly. We are going to go and have a look over this bridge at the... Um, get out. It's beautiful, isn't it? There's your farm just up the way. One thing I didn't look at is the price of this forestry area. So that's just under a million for this area here. Let me have a look. Oh. There's a little bit there, 510,000, a little bit of trees with the sawmill area. Lovely. Very picturesque. Very picturesque, I must say. Oh! So it looks like you dump your logs into the water um, to uh, sell them. Yeah. Let's check that out. So there we go. We've uh, dumped some logs into the old, uh, the old place there. Boom. Yes. You drop them in the water to sell. Fantastic. And there is your um, wood chip cell point. Very lovely, lovely area. Okay, we're going to uh, go back over the bridge. And we're going to go across by the looks of it. Oops. Safety first. So another cell point there. Just there. What's this one? Let's have a look here. Parliament. Promise manure. <laughs> I like the name. Yes. Yes, I like that name. Parliament Promise Manure. I'm loving it. Um, that's manure. <laughs> and, and slurry. Sales points there. 
Just checking all the crops have got sell points because um, I haven't got maps. I've no, I did, I did have a quick look, a quick glance. Um, I have seen maps that don't sell oats and things like that, but they have them on the fields. So there we go. I like that. Parliament's promised manure. Love it. Uh, there's the animal area. What we'll do, we'll just nip round. I think we can go round here. Yes, this is, is another placeable area if you wish to put sheds, farm, anything like that. Lovely jubbly. Can we nip down? Automatic barriers. I like that. Nobody likes being a gateman. No. Can I can I pick these up? Oh, oh I can. Luke, so you've got seed. Um, you got a little bit of lime and some liquid fertilizer, really, to get you going. Let's have a look here. Um, I take it if I, if I load my wagon up with these, I'm not I'm not going to get charged. I don't, I don't want to get done for necking them. You know what I mean? A little bit of fur there, liquid, solid fur, liquid fur, small seedage. Oh, yes. That's a nice thing. And you come in here with your trailer. And uh, there you go. You're going to get your animals. Wonderful. So what's this little little area here let's have a look Luke is all you got let's uh, is this like a bale cell point uh, silage I think that is isn't it yeah not used to these icons so that's a silage selling point um, I don't have the BGA let's let's do that actually. Let's just compare prices here. There we go. We've got the biogas plant. Oh, goodness gracious. Look at that. The biogas plant. <gasps> An amazing price. An amazing price. I'm worth doing that uh, field field of corn. How much are corn prices? I don't know what corn looks like uh, on these bloody icons. Right, there you go. So uh, a little bit more for um, if you chaff it, rather than if you sell for corn. There you go, peeps. Right, let's. Uh, Zoom out again. On top, just a quick glimpse of the map. I'm going da straight down here. To a left at the end, left and right, and then we'll go to the Hastings Wall. Lovely, um, rather squarish fields just down on this section here. That's better. I can see where I'm going when I bump into them trees. Um, so going all the way to the end. And if you notice as well, um, if you did decide to drop the trees, there's plenty of expansion on these fields. Plenty of expansion. Could make um, an, at least that another another few rows uh, with a harvester. Make that quite a quite a hefty field. This road could go. Uh, you could make this one big field between the one on the left and the one on the right. Oh, let's get in 
we see where we're going. So here we have the, uh, I nearly said Woolery. I nearly said Woolery, but I'm not going to. Um, here we have the spinnery for your wool and uh, cotton. I think I think the map does cotton, doesn't it? Let's just have a look. There we go. There we go. So there's a couple of places for cotton to sell. Uh, we're going to have a look at this little area just over here. Another placeable. Well, I can get out of that end. It's quite a large placeable area. Now, there's a cell point here, but it's not marked on the said map. That I can say is this a site? That, this does look like a place. Uh, It's not giving me a mark on the on the map, so I'm not sure what this place is. But it certainly does look like a cell point. So that's your mystery one. <laughs> and we come round here. This looks very dairy-ish with all the pipe work. There's your sails there. Just on the floor. Hall. And uh, we're back. Let's have a look at this nice big field here. It's a lovely field, isn't it? Get some old equipment on here to fit in with the old, uh, the old style stuff, and um, take you a little while. Take you a little while to do this field this size. Right, folks, that's it from uh, Old Kiwi Farm. I hope you like the video. I hope you like the map. And um, I'll see you next time. So from me down under, stay safe, take care, look after yourself. Enjoy whatever you're doing. And until next time, bye-bye.